Hello guys, welcome back to Vlogmas Day 21. We are currently sitting on my bedroom floor and today we are gonna make a little Christmas makeup look. I really enjoy doing makeup looks every once in a while even though I don't really wear makeup just because it's so fun playing with makeup to me. So we are gonna go for some red lips, a little bit of a smoky eye and a lot of bronze because we don't want to look like ghosts during Christmas. I know that I currently look like a wet dog. I just took a shower but it's gonna be fine in the end. It's all gonna be good. Without further ado, I'd say let's go ahead and start right into it. Okay, so first we are gonna take that hair back because even though it's so cute it's so annoying when you do your makeup so let me get some clips let's hope that my bangs still fall nicely after I just clip them up that would be so annoying to like wash my hair have it be nice and then for them to just fall like shit so fingers crossed Okay, cute. So starting with the base layer, we actually don't have one <laughs> because I never, I don't even have foundation and I don't know where I put my concealer other than the fact that it's like expired or it's been expired for like two years anyway. So I shouldn't be using that actually. So I'm just going to use my e.l.f. palette and I'm going to use that lightest color and just put it on some of the spots that I think need it. So under my eyes, on some red spots and then it's going to be good. We're going to freestyle it. This actually worked out pretty well. As I said, this only has like really neutral colors and I really just want to keep it cool for the eyes because then obviously we're going to go for a red lip. So let's just try something cute. So I'm going in with this first and then I might dabble into some of the darker colors. We could stay. Maybe kiss a bit and dream away. And then while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate bar. Now going into a darker warm color, I'm taking the one right next to it and I'm just placing this on the outer corner and not dragging it in as much to create more of like a cat eye look because I don't want to go for a smoky eye. Okay, so now I'm taking the darkest brown color in this palette and I'm really just stomping it on the very outside of my eye and also dragging it on the lower lash line. So to blend everything out a bit, I'm just taking the lightest color that I just dipped my face with and I'm just brushing it onto like the whole eye just to avoid any harsh lines whatsoever. Cause all I want is to spend this day with you to bring some brightness back into that eye, I'm taking this really light, it's almost like a pinkish color, so I never ever use this, but it's actually a really nice contrast to that brown, so I'm just stomping this on, and then also right into the inner corner. I would actually love some sparkle on there, but I don't have anything like that, so I might just put some highlighter on it and like call it a day. Cute, I like that, so just blending over with that same color that we used earlier, so everything is nice and blended, and then I think we are done for the eyes. Okay, so I really like how that turned out. I'm gonna put some mascara on. I would actually love like a dark brown winged eyeliner, but I don't have anything like that. So we're just gonna put some mascara on and then I think we are done with the eyes. It only took me 60 minutes. Wow. <laughs> It gets me every single time. Mascara is literally the best thing in the world. It looks so much better with on. Okay, looking good so far. I really packed on that mascara big time, but I think it looks really nice. I'm in love with the eyes. I think it looks so cute. So let's match the face with the eyes. So we are gonna go hard on bronzer. Yeah, I have no excuse for that. <laughs> That's just how it goes. Um, before that though, I'm gonna put some liquid blush on because I really like the look of it and I don't actually have any powder blush right here. So I'm just gonna put this on here and I really, as you can tell, I use a lot because I really like that blush look. So I go really up on under my eyes and also on my nose and um, this actually was a bit too much but that's fine that's actually a lot too much <laughs> That's okay, we're just gonna pretend, I mean, it's Christmas, we're all drinking some wine, it's warm inside, so we might actually tone that down with some powder. Let me... But the difference this time is that ever since July... So next, my favorite part in the whole world bronzer. I'm using the Bahama Mama bronzer, which is so freaking good, so we're really gonna go in there. Let's go. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I've longed for this moment to have you for 
as I said, go big go go home. This is what we've done. Got that milk highlighter in the color lit. And we're just gonna blend that out with a highlighting brush before we put the powder highlighter on. Very lightly because we don't want to overdo it. I'm gonna take the Pure Nude Essence highlighter and I'm just gonna tap my cheekbones. And I'm also gonna take my little pinky and put it in the highlighter and I'm gonna put it in my inner corner that really works. I am loving this sweat so far. It looks so cute. I look so tan. It's actually crazy. I'm not that tan in real life. I think all that we really have to do is lips now. And I got two different lip options. I got the Maybelline Superstay 24 color in Red Alert. This is really comfortable to wear because it has like that hair stick that you can put on throughout the day. So it doesn't like dry out your lips like crazy. And also the color I feel like is really, really nice. Just a really bright red. But my personal favorite when it comes to red lipstick is actually the Fenty Beauty in uncensored because this is like the most pigmented stuff you will ever ever put on your lips it's actually so good so i think i'm gonna go with that one but before that i forgot that we didn't have any brows yet so i'm just gonna quickly use my artico brown stick to just give me back some brows and then we're almost done Okay, so brows are on, eyes are on, mascara is on, blush is on, highlight is on, bronzer is on, no foundation is on because we don't have any foundation, and I think all that is missing now really is lips. So this is so cute, but I'm gonna have to be real quiet because if I mess this up, you will never get this off your face. So a minute of silence, please, so I can properly do my lips. So this is the finished makeup look. I love this lipstick, it's so freaking good. Let me just quickly undo my hair and see if my bangs do what I want them to do. Okay, so that was not a good idea. Okay, so this is the best that we're gonna get for my bangs. I'm just quickly gonna change into a different outfit. Okay, so this is the finished look, you guys. This is the full makeup and my outfit. I just put on shirt to kind of like make it look a bit fancier. And this is what it looks like. I really liked how it turned out and I actually don't really mind that much blush. It just looks so cute. I actually look a bit sunburned, but that's like kind of the goal here to look like we've just been out in the sun. So I really love it. I hope that you guys liked it too. And yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow, obviously. I hope you had an amazing day and bye-bye.